Yo, the All-Star game was cool, bro. Like, the three-point contest uh, was fire to watch. Mikey Skill competition was okay. Just uh, dunk contest. 20 months. 20 months with Fot Trace Obuyaka Trace Obuyaka. Mikey, you got down big for the big 20 months, man. I really appreciate it. The dunk contest, man, that's what I'll tell you. I did not have good seats. All right? But I don't want to be ungrateful. In my vlog, y'all are going to see me joke about my seats was bad. I'm going to joke about it. But at the end of the day, they was free. I'm not tripping. Like, I'm not an ungrateful ass. If I get anywhere free, I'm in this trip. I'm chilling. So what I can say is, with me being so far at the dunk contest, I really couldn't see the impact of how dope some dunks was, but I could tell when some dunks was just trash. Like, shout out to Jalen Brown. I think Jalen Brown is getting too much hate, though, honestly. Um, but I don't think he had a great dunk contest. I want to give a shout out to Jalen Brown only was only because, bro, I'm keeping it a book. He's he up. When the last time you seen the star of Jalen Brown caliber really fucking doing a dunk contest? He don't do it no more. He don't do it. So I'm like, all right, yo, shout out to Jalen. You know what I'm saying? It's cool. I appreciate you, but I can't say they was bugging with his scores. Though. I was giving him too high, too many high scores. They was doing what they was. They was. They was giving him too many high goddamn scores. It's ridiculous. But I don't Fuck think that his dunks was as bad as everybody say, months, except one. Big forty four. That that I think the last dunk when he dunked over Kai. And show on this calls a chair deck. Nah, I ain't gonna lie. He probably had two ass dunks. He had two ass dunks. Yeah, not them hoes was trash. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. Like, I hit no name. Yes. Okay. Did this just use an NFL boost grip glove to get over left dunk? You kidding me? <laughs> and then he tried to like dare he. No, bro. No, bro. But at the same time, nigga, do you know how hard, bro, y'all niggas don't know how fire it was in person to watch this nigga dunk and then the court turn into the garden. I don't give a how, what nobody say. I don't care how it looked on TV in person. That was tough. I ain't never seen no shit like that, bro. That shit was so tough. They was booing this shit out that nigga, though. Oh my God, he was born in dog. That shit was hilarious, man. Also, yo, uh, Indiana, what y'all got against Dame? Boy, when Dame won the, uh, <laughs> when Dame won the MVP, they booed this shit out Dame. In my blog, I'm yelling, respect Dame Dollar. Respect Dame Dollar. <laughs> <laughs> hey, dog, they was booing Dame bad as shit, bro. I ain't even a Dame fan. I just started yelling, respect Dame Dollar, bro. That's hilarious. Oh my God, bro. We hate him. What did he do to Indy? They won to Halley? Yo, yo, man, first of all, yo, I met Halley in person. Um, Really cool motherfucking guy, man. Really cool dude. Been knowing of him for a while, but but to finally meet him in person, man, no cap. Just resubscribed. Been for rooting for months. you to have success, Been gang. I, I, I root for it even w more now, bro, Kwame even Brown. more. Yo, you a real super cool ass dude, man. Um, had a had a small conversation with him, just nothing too major. Really cool dude, man. Uh, who else I had a conversation with? Y'all seen on the stream? I talked to uh people like uh Michael Parsons. Um, who else did I have on the stream? Jada Kiss, Jada Kiss. Oh man, that was a fire moment, dog. The Jada Kiss moment was was amazing. Uh, because my stepdad, who's no longer with us, was a big Jada Kiss fan. So for me to do that, that was like, yo, that's hard, bro. That's tough. Just Couple score. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, we'll be on that. Months. Yo, uh, Cash, yo, yeah, I met Cash again. It's like my fourth, fifth time meeting Cash. Cool, my dude, bro. Period. Don't got nothing more. No, I don't have nothing but good words to say about Cash. Met Troy Dan, cool dude. Every, I, I didn't meet anybody that was like weird. Nobody. Everybody was cool. Everybody, bro. So, man, I, I, I had, I had a great weekend, bro. I had a great weekend, dog. TTG, man, yo, I, yo, Zach, I, I didn't met Zach a few times. Why do I got a sock on the floor? Sean Thedon just for resubscribed sure. for 14 Let's do it again. What's up, gangster? How's my little chocolate drop? Who the f*** are you talking to? Camera size. Oh, man, bro. Yo, 
Uh, you know, I give I give you a few story times about Indy as well, man. Um, I played I played on the two K League uh version of the NBA two K again. Clutch the shooter um, just resubscribed for thirty six months. Clutch, what's the word? No need to fear. Clutch is here. How long am I streaming? Uh, I'll be streaming for a while. True or die? I want to play it with Runchy. I think Runchy is um this salmon ass think... hoodie on. Look like some bubble gum, and you ain't slick. I know you was getting freaked out in Vegas for All Star Weekend. It was an indie. Glad to see you back. It was, long way. it was an indie. It was an indie. It was an indie. It was an indie. Hey, say, I'm not going to say your name. Who just followed me? Boy, you got a freaky ass name. What made you make that mother name? Could y'all see who just followed? This is sick. Hey, who the is on your profile? Who is this? Is that Papa John? Crazy ass name. <laughs> Papa John. <laughs> oh my God, bro. Yo, Andy, man. Um, a few things, bro. I've been to Andy like probably like over ten times at this point, man. So I don't have too much new about the city. Um, what I can say is, bro. Uh, y'all Uber drivers are unique. First of all, a lot of y'all cars stink. Period. Uber needs to have some kind of shit to where if your car smell to a certain level, you can't Uber. Why your car stank? Second of all, I'm being honest, bro, and I don't want to come off in a mean way. I'm not a bullshit at all. But no cap, man. Yo, Osama Ben FOT, nigga. <laughs> w motherfucker name, bro. All right. Yo, um, can Uber drivers leave me alone? Like, sometimes I don't feel like talking, bro. And for some reason in Uber, Uber Comfort was cheaper than a regular Uber. If you don't know what Uber Comfort is, it's supposed to be newer cars and you can pick if you want to talk or not. I'm in this saying I don't want to talk. I just want to just, just chill. And the reason why is because like Uber drivers be kind of awkward, man. I'm sorry. They just, they keep asking me, am I from out of town? Bro, just, I just want to get, get to where I'm going. These keep talking, bro. Keep talking, and I, I honestly I, I can't say too much because I'm, I'm out of town. And I'm carless, like so. Such a carless saying something, just enjoy the ride. But damn, the, the ego is showing. I don't have an ego, bro. Like yo, y'all not in that car. I'm gonna give you an example. It was me, my dog Kobe, and Dom. We went to a Wayne show in Indy, bro. First of all, my first time going to a concert since I was like 11, bro. But new here, you you literally a my. Since I was like 11, bro, man, bro, the Wayne concert was so fire, dog. I can show y'all videos of it, but you really, it really don't show how lit that shit really was, bro. Wayne was playing that shit. So we in the car talking about how lit it was. The Uber driver started butting in. Yeah, man, that's how you can tell if somebody's really a good artist or not. If they like, if they kill it at concert, man, like. That's, that's, that's how you know they really good. I was like, yeah, 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 yeah. You ain't lying. You ain't lying. But then he just kept going. Yeah, man, I grew up listening to Metallica and all of those guys, man. My mom, man, my mom, bro, like, I really can list all of the songs. I can list all of the songs growing up. I was like, yeah, word. Word, yeah, you can. Yeah, man, but then also it's the vice versa, you know? Yeah, you know, like, some guys, they just... The song, it sounds good in the car, and then all of a sudden you get here, it sucks, bro. It's just, I'm like, please, shut the fuck up. <laughs> shut the fuck up. <laughs> no, I can't even, bro, you killed our whole conversation because you decided to keep talking to us and didn't overtake the conversation. So the whole ride, we decided, all right, let's just, Let's just stop talking real quick. We'll stop talking. And he'll, he'll say something that you're supposed to reply to. We stop talking. You guys ever heard of the band Skinny Leopards? Oh, man, those guys, man. Yeah, bro. I'm trying to tell you, man, they're a new band. <laughs> they might be on some new. But shut up. Damn, bro. But that's that's how it went, bro. But uh, again, I'm being respectful. I don't have a car. It is what it is. I'm going to leave it alone, bro. So. My last night in Indy, let me tell you how it went. 
So I go to Indy. I get an invite to a party. And I, I, it was a last minute invite. I probably wouldn't be supposed to be getting invited. But I'm like, you know what? They invited me. I said, man, I appreciate. Thank y'all. I come, right? So, boom, I end up going. And the party was fire, bro. Party was cool. All kind of people there. I'm like, yo, this is dope, man. It's my last night here. Let's do it. I ran into, I ran into this, into this, like, this girl. She was like a white girl, right? Dick, you know what I'm saying? Snow. 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 On Black History Month. No, but hold on, though. I'm telling you, I'm not really fucking with her, though. I'm really not fucking with her. Because I'm not in this party to fuck with nobody for real. I was talking to this other shorty. She was sticked in the bitch, too. But I could tell she wouldn't know nothing. I wouldn't know shit anyway, so we just let it be. Now, this white girl started talking to me. And she was fucking with me a little bit. But it was something about her vibe I just wasn't fucking with. I just wasn't fucking with it, man. I was like, what, well, she had these big fake-ass lips? Them hoes look terrible, dog. Oh, my God. Her lips was weak as fuck. Big and fake, bro. And then she had a big ass. I ain't gonna lie. Thick than a motherfucker. But she wasn't really doing nothing, which is fine. Like, people don't dance with each other anymore. But uh, while I was talking to her, the other shorty, the black shorty, she got jealous and started to try to talk to me even more. I was like, baby, I already figured you ain't no shit. Leave me alone. All right? You ain't no shit. Leave me alone, please. Thank you so much. All right? So I'm just talking to the white shorty just to talk to her. I, I promise I'm not trying to get her number or no, none of that. I don't know how the fuck I get her Instagram. I got her Instagram. I think maybe I asked for it. I don't remember ever asking for it. But I do remember her mentioning at one point in time she don't use Instagram, which was crazy. But at this point in time, I'm off a few drinks, though. I'm off, show it? Nah, I'm, I'm cool on it. I'm off a few drinks. And something about her not sitting right with me, nigga. So my dog Kobe in the function, I say, Kobe, I'm off a few drinks, but I'm not fucking with this bitch. And make sure I get home safe tonight, <laughs> I told, I told my nigga, make sure I get home safe tonight. So, so the Kobe nigga, he was like, he said, like, oh, nah, I ain't fucking with it either, but I, I already see the vibe. So, boom, what then happens is um, a nigga came by us. A nigga came by us, and she was like, oh, hey, this is my cousin. Bro, black as hell. That's your who? That's your who? That nigga ain't your motherfucking cousin. So then, then what happened was, um, what happened was she was like, don't he look like Mike Epps? Don't he look like Mike Epps? I looked at him. I said, hell nah, he don't look like Mike Epps. Stop playing with my nigga. I'm just trying to get these niggas away from me at this point. Just, just, just chilling. Like, he was like, he was like, hold on, nigga. Mike Epps, my uncle. What the fuck you mean? <laughs> I was like, I was like, I was like, and again, I'm off, of, I'm, I'm off a little bit of the drinks. I'm off a little bit of the drinks. I was like, I was like, nah, bro. Like, I ain't gonna lie, bro. I was really trying to help you out because I thought she was trying to play you, bro. You know what I'm saying? I was really trying to help you out, bro. But shit, I ain't gonna lie. I see it a little bit because I ain't gonna lie. The motherfucker looked like Mike Epps. He was Mike Epps with brains. But I'm trying to help you out, nigga. I'm trying to help you out. You know how, bro, no cap. You know how when somebody, bro, you can tell when a girl trying to play you in front of other girls. So I'm like, nah, I ain't going to let her play on. Yo, yo this, this nigga tells me, hey, yeah, nigga, Mike Epps, nigga, that's my daddy brother. I was like, all right, nigga. All right, nigga, what the fuck you want, nigga? Like, so, so then I was like, bro, get these niggas away from me. Fucking Indy animals, bro. Get these niggas up out of here, bro. I was trying to be a W man's, bro. But then, yo, the, 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 the white shorty, I ain't gonna lie, I got the vibe. She was trying to set me up. <laughs> hey, she kept trying to be by me and shit. I was like, nah, baby, I got to get home. I don't want no snow. snow.
I don't want no snow. I don't want Nathaniel. Oh no, bro. But then, uh, no. <laughs> and then she was in my ear trying to make it seem like she's such a holy girl, talking to me on some like, yeah, I be in the house, I don't do nothing. At this point, she's off the liquor and she forgot that I got her Instagram. I swear to God, I don't know how I got it. Nigga, I go back to my hotel room. This bitch was our OnlyFans demon. Demon, nigga. Demon. Bro, you Google her name, go to her Twitter. That tweet, that pin tweet was crazy. 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 You couldn't tell? Yeah, I could tell. Come on, bro. You got fake lips and a big nasty ass. Somebody gonna get you pregnant one day. <laughs> <laughs> And it ain't going to be me. No, I got, bro, you go, you're not going to tell me you be in the house. I, I know how you look. I know how you look, bro. You trying to get, you trying to trap a nigga with money. Baby, I ain't got nothing for you. All right, boy, stop, bro. Give me a, drop the IG for science. I am absolutely not. I am not doing that. She work from home. Get the fuck out of here, nigga. Absolutely not. A big nasty, yeah, yeah, I ain't gonna lie. That shit was big, but it was nasty. That motherfucker. Droopy, droop, droop, droop. Why did I tell that story? I don't motherfucking know, man. But yeah, man, and it was cool, man. Seen a whole lot of people, bro. Uh, Got to um, have some dope, conversa dope conversations. Topped up with Sunny Digital, uh, the producer, Sunny Digital. Real cool people. I met Keith Lee. Um, If y'all remember, I had a tweet that go, that went, well, uh, post that went viral. Million on TikTok. I think two million on Instagram uh, about like when when you gatekeeping food. The rest are no nigga. The food nigga, bro. Uh, I think it's in my phone. Whatever, y'all don't give a fuck to see the picture. I took a picture with the nigga, but then I talked to him for a split. Oh, y'all can see my phone. That's too much. Make sure put my phone over here. What the fuck? Y'all see my password? Oh no. <laughs> Mariah Mills, get the fuck out of here. Nah, shit, I, I ain't gonna lie. I'll watch it before I put that bitch live. Before I put that bitch live. Absolutely not, nigga. Uh, I, I ain't gonna lie, boy. You got to look close. I'm gonna change my password, Nick. <laughs> All right. Black nigga ignore me. What, bro, what you said, Ja? Yo, shout out to the subs I met, too. Damn, it's one sub. I told you something that I was gonna give you something. I ain't gonna leak it because somebody else is gonna do it. L screen saver, nigga. I don't have one. Nigga, I don't got nothing. Oh. <coughs> I think somebody in Indy stole my phone. Right now I'm working with one phone. I think one of you Indy animals stole my motherfucking phone. You so free. One of the Indy animals stole my phone, bro. Find my iPhone, that's a phone I didn't have it on. That's the one I didn't have it on. They got me, yo. A smooth lick. Indy animal is crazy. And like, I forgot, my sister got my location on one of my phones, bro. So I really could have told her what was up, but I got on the plane, my, my shit gone, bitch. Nigga got my ass, bro. It's on me now, get your motherfucking ass on, nigga. Why would I not have it on? Because it was a it was a brand new phone, basically. Um, but it was cracked, though. Uh, What happened was, uh, my old phone got fucked up, all right? So I ordered a new phone, to send my old one back, I had to turn off. You got to turn off, find my iPhone, right? So I turned that bitch off, sent the old phone in. They mailed me another one. Um, With that phone, I dropped it like a week after having it. That was my first time dropping a phone in like 10 years. I told y'all about that, right? So, but I never turned find my iPhone on that phone. Um, Went out of town, niggas lost my shit. Or somebody somebody must got my shit. I don't know what the fuck happened, bro. Yo, w, yo, WMOD, the niggas a trash troller. All right. SMH, yeah, it's cool. So this is from iPod in, I'm assuming, Indy. <coughs> I Almost Died is the title of the clip. I'll never forgive Trey. And I'll never forgive Trey. Because it don't matter who else took the shot with us. I'll never forgive this nigga for making me drink all that Hennessy in one fucking drink. Chat? What Hennessy? This shit was not a fucking shot. 
it was damn near half the fucking glass. What Hennessy though? I mean glass, I mean if it was a fucking cup, I was holding it like this. It wasn't a little shot glass like this. No, 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 no. I did not have my fucking fingertips on this fucking cup. I was holding that bitch like it was a regular fucking cup. Okay? It was fucking crazy. I almost died. Uh-oh. I remember taking a shot with him, but I don't remember what we was at. And I forgot who pulled that shit. Almost died. I don't remember Baby, this. Almost died. See, see, now my wife is here. Oh, I'm sorry. What does wife say? Because I don't want to get in trouble. Oh, really? <laughs> Listen, Miss I Park King Carter, I don't remember this. I don't remember this. <laughs> Yo, no cap. I'm being dead serious. I really wish I could remember, bro. I kind of remember us taking a shot, but that, that that's probably why how, how insignificant it was, bro. I part don't drink, bro. So I part think that anything is a big shot. He don't drink. And I ain't gonna lie. I, I, I'm a social drinker. I don't drink on my free time. I only, if it's a random Wednesday, I'm not gonna drink. But if I go out and we in a social environment, I'm like, you know what? All right, I'll go to the bar and get a shot. It is what it is. I'll do it. All right, boom. Let's see the next one. See, see, now my wife is here. You out drinking. All right, let's go. We're about to get, we're about to get him in trouble. Let's get up out of there. All right, this is the next one. Fuck it, bro. This kid. Oh, can I get a picture? Can I get a picture? Oh, my God. Oh, can I do this? Oh, can I do this? I just want to let y'all know Trey opened that door. No, I did not. Hell no. Oh, Trey. <clears throat> let me explain to y'all what happened because I didn't tell the story. All-Star Weekend. I said I didn't have good tickets. That's true for every event except the first one, the Celebrity Game. Celebrity Game, I had some amazing tickets. Those, well, honestly, they were amazing and ass at the same time. Like, let me explain to you why. This is the closest I've ever been to a basketball court. We was in a suite. Right, it was a lower suite, but the problem was there was fans in front of us, and to see the game, you can't sit down in your seat. You had to stand up. All right, let me get my phone so I can get y'all a video. There was one annoying kid. He was so fucking annoying. Parents, when you go out, don't let your kid be that annoying kid. Please, don't let your kid be that annoying fucking kid, bro. This kid, every celebrity that ran around, he's yelling their name. And yeah, that's cool because you are in the environment for celebrities you might have never seen before. You might never see in well, life. Well, Gunkler Rob just resubscribed for 23 months. He watching right now. You break it. I'm going to tell you why he not watch because he don't know who the fuck I am. And it's funny. I'm wearing the same hoodie right now. I was wearing that day. I actually got on the same hat. So uh, I some, some people saw me. I was on Cash Nasty Story, right? All of this matters. I'm not just calling it out. This matters. So we get in here. Hashtag stank. We got me fucked up. We get in there. It took us a while to get our tickets, but we finally get there. We get there when the game is first starting. I hear a kid yelling, 50 cent! 50 cent! 50 cent! I'm like, damn, what the fuck 50 is? Like, is he close? What the fuck is 50? He keeps yelling 50 cent. I swear to God, it's the first celebrity name he yells. And I'm, damn, what the fuck? I look over. The kid is right up over the Raptors looking at me like this. 50 cent! But he's not looking at me, though. He made eye contact with me because I, I caught him. But he looked at me. He went, 50! And started yelling 50 cent again. I'm like, what the fuck is going on? So... Let me go full screen. Boom. What then happens is, um, he keep yelling for 50. Keep yelling for him. And he stayed yelling 50 cent name for a while until I never knew what 50 was at. But then finally, 50 ends up getting up and walking by the sideline far away from us. I said, now, why the fuck is he yelling for 50 cent when 50 ain't even that close to us? He's not. He not the farthest, but he ain't that close. Why are you yelling this nigga name? But then he went, Michael Parsons, Michael, 
Michael Parsons. So Michael Parsons is was the only celebrity that I know that turned around and went, he, yeah. And he never called Michael Parsons name again. Let me get, let, uh, let me see if I can find the seat so y'all can get it. Let's show y'all our seats. This is what we were sitting at. We were in the suite. This is when we first walk in. You got iPod right here. Us, oh, my guy, Dirk. Let's keep it going. All right, found our seats. Look. Oh, no, no, no. Let me see. Make sure I ain't redo this. I think I fucked up on this one. No. All right, boom. Whatever. I'm going to skip past us talking. Y'all can see this when I put my vlogger. We get to our spot. This is what we sitting at. Same hoodie I see. I told you, nigga. This, look at these seats. I've never had no seats this good in my life. Never. These seats was fucking crazy, right? But the problem is, as you can see, there's people right here. There's also people right here, and people are going to keep walking back and forth. So when you sitting down, you can't really, you can't necessarily see something. Now, when you standing up, it's cool. But when you sitting down, no, you're fried. So this is just me talking. Boom. <clears throat> Frank got to fuck with me. Let me show you where this kid was sitting at. You walk through. The here, here is the bars where he's yelling 50 cent. And he keeps yelling. Now, what seat did I sit at? I end up sitting right here. I sit in the second seat. Because I probably sit in the third. I sit in the second. I'm just trying to get decent seats. Let's go back to this thing right here. Let's see the other story uploaded. Did it not go through? <laughs> okay, I need to upload it. Play burner. <clears throat> it's preparing. I don't know why it didn't go through. So he just keeps yelling celebrity names and he got so motherfucking annoying. I was like, bro, where is this kid's parents, bro? Somebody tell her, bro, to get. Stop. Stop. And I wasn't being unreasonable, bro. He was real life being uh, so annoying. <laughs> we got this kid. Yeah. He keep yelling celebrities' names. <laughs> bro. Hell no. He bro. deserves it. No, we got a kid. Any celebrity he sees, he's yelling. He's been yelling Pat McAfee. Oh I told you, Pat McAfee! Pat McAfee! Stop. <laughs> he been going crazy, bro. Let's see. Hold on. We love you, Pat! We love you, Pat! <laughs> we love you, Kai! <laughs> TSJ <laughs> just resubscribed for 12 months. Oh, fuck. <laughs> hey, I appreciate you, bro. Now, now I'm going to let iPod. Wait, hold on. Do I tell my part of the story or do I let iPod tell it and then I interfere? Because eventually he wasn't messing with me. But then he started to mess with me. He kept calling for people. You know what? I'm going to let iPod tell it. I pop, what you gotta say? Fuck it, bro. This kid. Oh, can I get a picture? Can I get a picture? Oh, can I be in your next videos? Oh, can I do this? I just wanna let y'all know Trey opened that door. Go, oh, Trey. It's, it's bad. Malik, it's bad. It's really bad. It's so bad. That the moment a Uber driver t tries to get it in in your conversation or even to start a conversation with you, him and Trey or her and Trey for the rest of the ride will be talking, conversating. Ah! It's bad, man. Ah! Trey needs help. Okay, he really needs help, man. It's, ah! it's, it's crazy, bro. It's crazy. Fuck so, it, bro. So I bought I bought to let you know. First of all, we're gonna take wait, wait, let's go back a little bit. Because he's not lying. 
Yo, people say I got an ego, and I know most of y'all are joking, but let me tell y'all real quick, real, real, real talk. I don't have an ego, bro. My problem is maybe I need to develop one, and I'm being dead serious because I never want to come off as rude to anybody, so I be so friendly with a lot of people, bro. No lies. So what I part is saying is if an Uber driver talks, I don't be wanting to be rude and just – be like, I don't want to talk to you. Well, if you say something where there's an open window for me to talk, I'm going to be quiet. I never do that. I never do that, bro. I, bro, no cap. If an Uber driver try to talk to me and I don't feel like talking, I'm just going to talk to you because I don't want to come off as rude. That's, what, that's just what I do. But iPod keep telling me, stop talking to these niggas. We don't want to talk. <laughs> we don't want to talk. So I'm going to give y'all an example of an Indy, no, this was Orlando during the 2K League draft. We had a fucking Uber driver. He was so fucking annoying, bro. He kept talking to us. And we was like, bro, please just, yo, who's that with the raid? Yo, Pod, 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 are we talking about you right now? Look, look, Pod is tired of my shit, bro. <laughs> Pod is tired of my real Southern and shit. We got manners, yeah, like, no cap, that's just, that's just what, that's just what it is, bro, but, I, I think maybe I got to develop a little bit of an ego or something just to make him stop. So let me go to the sales squad discord because we had this fucking Uber driver in Orlando in January the 11th. I typed, we in a smelly Uber right now. I did type, I typed the iPod. This fucking Uber driver won't shut the fuck up because he kept talking to me, bro. Now, obviously I'm going to say that, but I'm not going to tell him that in his face. Cause that's rude, bro. That's rude, bro. Right? So I'm about to read our messages in sale if if you don't mind our part. I ain't gonna say I ain't gonna say too much. I'm gonna read our message from January 11. We are in Indy. And then let me show you the Uber. Gang had a dent in his door. I'm not gonna lie, bro. Uber was crazy. Yo, if you working in the Uber, if you're working in the Uber. Wait, you was in Orlando without my clearance. Next time you do that, I gotta make the hashtag boss call. Watch yourself, nigga. Hold on. Hey, let me take the audio from y'all to make sure we don't say nothing crazy in this clip. Boom. I'm not a bougie nigga. And what y'all need to know is the phone make it look better. This nigga who Carly was in was dirty. As fuck. This is one Uber driver. And his car was stinky. His car stunk like ass. TOS, fuck you, boy. All right. And then, so Chase said, your face is the meme, whatever. It don't matter. Uh, later on, here we go. This is, iPod hit me up. iPod says, I was like, yo, iPod, dog, this Uber driver won't shut the fuck up. He says, if you stop responding and starting conversations, we might make it out here alive. Then I said, nigga, he was just being nosy doing it. I said, nigga, oh, hold on, let me see. Nigga asking about a woman, about a road, about a woman. Focus on the road. That nigga said he got that teacup. Get out. Fake sleep with me. Our boy told me to fake sleep. He told me to fake sleep with an Uber driver. So the Uber driver can stop talking. The Uber driver kept talking to us. That nigga said, hey, fake sleep with me. Nah, y'all niggas weirdos. Who the fuck weirdo? Boy, you out chill motherfucking mind, bro. All right, so boom. We had this Uber driver. I'm finna give you an example about him because then we finna go back to the kid. All right, I'm gonna skip this. So what happens is the fucking Uber driver, he keeps talking. We, I finally get to the point. He said something that wasn't a, that, that I didn't need to reply to. I stopped talking. He was driving for two minutes. He realized that we wasn't talking. He busts out and yells, so who's Antonio? I say, I started crying. And I'm like, I'm like, I say, yeah, Antonio, he's the guy that booked our Uber. It's, that's not one of, neither one of our names. Nigga, the who's Antonio? Made me start crying, bro. So then <laughs> I bought the SMS. <laughs> it was quiet, bro. All you hear is a click. Look, 
I'm not gonna play the video. I'm gonna let you listen to the music he was playing in his car. Who's Antonio? He just, this is how we driving. So who's Antonio? Like, and he would not stop and you responded. So then guess what? I'm over here, I bought fake sleeping. I probably got glasses on. Hold on, I'm put my glasses on. This is what I probably was doing. That nigga I probably put his glasses on on purpose and went. Faking like a bitch. <laughs> Faking like a <laughs> So then, so then the nigga said, who's I bought? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! So I, was like, I said, I just started crying again, and I was like, "Yeah, that's my dog name over here, bro. That's my dog." He said, "Your name's iPod." I've never met anyone named no way. Your name's iPod, and he keep trying to talk to iPod. I wanted to kill both of you, <laughs> but look, this how you know iPod gassing it though, because. I didn't respond. I didn't respond. Like, and it wasn't on no rules shit. You a bitch. What? It wasn't even on no rules. I was like, I was like, shit, not me. I bought you a woke. Tell that nigga your name. I bought. So then, so then, so, so nobody said nothing. He just, he just keeps going. There, I've never met no one named iPod. No way your name's up. Is that really your name? Is that really your name? I said, I said, yo, Pod, that's your name, bro. Let me see what Pod did. Pod with. Yo. What, what was it? <laughs> ah, you're not sleeping, nigga. You're not sleeping. <laughs> ah, that nigga's sick as fuck. Oh my God. No. That nigga said, Yo, what was it? You heard the whole conversation, gang. Hold on. Let me see. Look, it's like, you know, chat, when I tell y'all a story, I'm telling the truth. Listen to this. It's the first three seconds of recording. <laughs> Is it really somebody's name, iPod? Look! The nigga! <laughs> that nigga wouldn't leave us alone. Oh, my God! No! Oh, bro, he wouldn't leave us alone, bro. He wouldn't stop talking to us, bro. Oh, my God, bro. Dog. <laughs> Pod woke up and did his YouTube intro. I'm fucking wheezing. So look, I cut this off. I didn't catch when the iPod first fake woke up. In the middle of the conversation, iPod fake went to sleep again. So y'all gonna catch him off the second fake wake up. All right, but let's keep it going. Here it go. Is it really somebody's name iPod? Yeah, his name's iPod, bro. For real? Oh yeah, what's up, Pod? Yo, he he don't he don't believe your name. Are you Pod? <laughs> yeah, he's Pod. Wow. Yo, listen to Pod in the background. I'm not, I've never met anybody that was named I Pod. He he never meet nobody like you, bro. You one of a kind. Yeah, one of, unique. <laughs> hey, you can hear me crying. Because at this point, I realize he's not about to stop talking. It don't matter what I do. He's not about to stop talking. So I said, you know what? Fuck it. I got a troll with this nigga, bro. I got a troll. Trey, you nice. Boy, that boy said you a nice nigga. That's what I be telling y'all, nigga. Nigga be trying to troll and say I got an equal. I know it's the trolls. But, bro, no cap. I really don't have one. I need to develop one. I got to stop talking to these niggas, bro. For real, bro. But let's keep it going. He ain't never meet nobody like you, bro. You one of a kind. Yeah, one of, unique. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah. And, uh, that's my stage name. Good. All right. So I appreciate you. <laughs> and then that's it. And then listen to the music you had to listen to. Oh, bitch, you went loud. Yo, you, you barely can hear it. But... So anyways, why does that make, why, what does that have to do with uh, Indianapolis for All-Star? I told y'all about the annoying kid. He keeps yelling celebrity names. 
They not answering him. So then all of a sudden I hear him yell. He didn't say it loud though, but he said, hey, guy in the pink. And I was like, no way he's talking about me. Please, God. Please, God, don't tell me he's talking about me. Please, God, no. Guy in the pink. Guy in the pink. I say, fuck, fuck, fuck. And I can't run away from this nigga. Shut up, Runchy. I can't run from this nigga. Same hoodie I'm wearing. Y'all know, I, I bought same hoodie, same hat. I can't run away from this nigga. He keeps yelling, guy in the pink, guy in the pink. So I turn around. What's good? Can I get a water? Miles Smokson just resubscribed for 16 months. Thank you, Trey and Fot, for being an amazing community. Yo, I appreciate you all really you. been there for a kid in hard times, brown <coughs> skin. Yo, hey, Miles, bro. I'm glad we can help you through your hard times, bro. No bullshit. I appreciate you for the support, game. That nigga say, can I get a water? And I say, I don't, I don't know where the water at. Now, you got to remember the kind of suite that we was in. This is what it looked like. Now, when you in a suite like this, when they book suites like this, it comes with free food and drinks, right? Free food. All of this was food. It was like, I think, what the fuck was right here? It was chicken tenders, burgers, all of this shit, whatever. But I didn't know where the drinks was. I had no clue. So the kid is sitting right here yelling, guy in the pink, guy in the pink. And I was like, yo, what's up? Can I get a water? I don't, I, I don't know where the water's at. He said, they're right over there. They're back there. The fuck? The fuck you mean by that? How the fuck you know where the water's at? And I don't know. Because they not, they were not in sight. I promise on my life, they were not in sight. They were in a refrigerator. But he fucking knew where they was. And I said, I was like, I told her, bro. I said, nah, bro, I ain't, I ain't gonna lie, bro. I ain't. I ain't trying to do that, bro. You, I was like, bro, nah, bro. You're going to get me in trouble. I joked with him. He said, please, can I get a water, please? I said, nah, bro. You're going to get me in trouble, bro. So then I part looked at me. I part said, I part say, what did he ask you? I said, he asked me for water. Now, this is where the nice part of me kicked in. I asked, I part I said, should I give him a water? I part I said, hell no. You give him a water, what's next? He wants chicken tenders. You don't give him no damn water. And I was like, I said, okay. My bad. my bad, bro. My bad. My bad. That nigga, I bought, I bought got out of my ass, bro. I bought got out of my ass. I ain't gonna lie. I thought about giving him a water for a second. I did, bro. I did. But then what happened was the kids started yelling, man, I'm thirsty. If I'm lying, I'm dying. If I'm lying, I'm dying. You hear me? The, the bro said, man, I'm thirsty, bro. Uh, oh, oh, I'm going to get to that part of the story. <laughs> I'm going to get to that. So then, so then what happened is, so no, what happened is, bro, I was like, oh, fuck, he thirsty, bro. He thirsty. So, I had went and got my food and I sat down to eat. I realized, oh fuck, now I'm thirsty. Now I'm thirsty. I probably had already ate his food and was going to go get himself something to drink. I said, yo, I probably, can you please get me something to drink? <laughs> ah! I said, I said, bro, five boy, can you please get something? I didn't want the little nigga to see me go get something to drink. Oh, my God. Oh, I was scared of the little nigga. I was scared of the little nigga, bro. Bro, I was scared of the nigga, bro. I pa said, no, you get up and get your own drink. You get up. I said, pa, bro. I, I told pa, I go, I said, I said, bro, please, please. <laughs> oh, my God. <clears throat> so then what happened is, so he, uh, he told the dude he didn't know where the water is. Like, yeah, that's why. I didn't want to get up because I told him I don't know where the water is. All of a sudden, I got a water. I'm not trying to be rude. I don't have a fucking ego. That's my problem. I need one. Okay? So then what happened is, what happened is, 
Boom, what then ends up happening is I part, I part a real nigga. He brings me, he brings me some water. He bring me some goddamn water. And then the little kid said, hey, guy in the pig. He got me with the water. He caught me with that water. He caught me with the fucking water, bro. And then, I ain't gonna lie, I had my water, I went. I started drinking myself. I started drinking. I did not make eye contact with that nigga, bro. Oh my God. So then what happened is he keeps fucking yelling. Now he's yelling for celebrities again. But then he start asking for water again. He say, please, can you get me a water? Now, luckily, one of the security guards, I got a video of it. One of the security guards caught him. He said, hey, no. And he told bro, you can't get no water from us. He left us alone about that. He left us alone. Now, again, remember, what you mean, nah, pot? Don't skip. What did I skip? Security guard belled you? Yes, he did. <clears throat> tell, no, no, I part, I part. That's not that time yet. That's not that time yet. I'm about to tell him that right now. So this whole time when I got my water, <clears throat> I didn't finish it. <clears throat> now, remember, I told y'all what seat I'm sitting in. I'm sitting in the second seat. We had assigned seats that really wasn't my seat. My seat was right. It was the third seat in the second row. So what then happens is while I'm watching the game, somebody tapped me on my shoulder. I look over, it's fucking cash nasty. He was like, yo, can I get my seat, big dog? I said, I said, oh shit. I proceed to tell Ken, I said, bro, you do not want this seat. I said, yo ass about to be fried. And he didn't, he, he was, he was, he was like, he, he just laughed. He was like, <laughs> yo, he said, man, I appreciate you, bro. Cause I got up and gave it to him. No problem. Who give a fuck? You can have a seat. Nigga, this ain't the best seat. But I, I am, this how you know I'm a W man's. I said, bro, you do not want this seat. You, I said, yo ass finna be fried. So then we sitting watching the game. He's yelling, Pat McAfee. Cash got his cameraman. I, Cash cameraman sits in this camera, sits in this seat. Cash Nancy sits in this one. <clears throat> so then what happens is Cash is recording. Oh my God, it's Cash Nasty. The kid found him. Now, when you watch Cash's vlog, Cash is going to put this kid in there. And you're going to see when the kid first discovered Cash. Cash played it cool. Cash like, <laughs> what's going on, man? What's going on? He said, oh, my God, Cash. Cash, where's uh, Pi? What's my nigga name, bro? From 2 I Jesser. He said, yo, where's Jesser? Yo. Pi, yo, Cash said, man, I, I would tell you what Jesser is if I knew, man. I don't know. I don't know what, I don't know what Jesser is, bro. So he was, Cash, can I be in a video? Here, take my number, Cash. Take my number here, here, here. I was like, oh my God, but what the fuck? Cash was like, yeah, yeah, all right. He said, Cash said, you know what? I'm going to put you in the video. Make sure you're watching the videos. We're going to have videos dropping in a little while. You can, when I put it down there, then make sure you apply to be in the video. So, boom. He was like, he said, yo, Cash, I've been watching forever. Oh, Cash, Cash, can I get a picture? Can I get a picture? So he gives, Cash gets up, and I think Cash gives him a picture. So then he, he wasn't satisfied with that picture. You thought he was done at that picture? You thought he was done? It's his first time seeing one of his one one YouTuber that he watched up close. So then he starts to keep calling Cash's name, and Cash just says, Cash goes, "Oh my God!" While he was trying to get his vlog off, he couldn't. He ruined Cash's motherfucking vlog. And this is why you shouldn't get that motherfucker water. You thought he was feeling you? Yo, you thought that picture was going to make him stop? He keeps yelling to Cash. So then, guess who walks by? TTG, Zach. What well, I'm sorry. Zach came in way before Cash. Zach sat on this aisle. He sat on this seat, like right over here. He's far from Cash. But then, all of a sudden, Cash had got up to go get some food. 
Zach said, yo, Cash, hold on. Let me ask you something. And then the guy said, yo, I know you from Jester's video too. What's your name? What's your name? What's your name? Zach, Zach, really cool guy. Zach's like, yo, what's going on, man? What's up with you, bro? So Zach went and talked to him for a good minute. And he just chatting with him and kicking it. Little bro stayed quiet for a while. He relaxed. But then he said, I hear him. Can I be in you guys' this video, bro? I love Jesser, bro. I love Jesser. I've been watching Jesser for so long, bro. Love it. So Zach saying, oh, no, he tells Zach. I even DM Zach asking him, can I, can I be in the video? I DM'd him. So Zach said, you know what? What's your Instagram? I don't have Instagram. So how did you DM Jesser? So anyways, so anyways, he was lying. He told him himself, but he was lying. All right, so then he said, he says, hold on, let me ask my dad if I can make an Instagram really quick. He runs up, and then this is when I realized, DM without account, can you even do that? I realized he was not even sitting in his fucking seat because he ran up to his dad, and his dad was so far from him. Why would you let your kid be down there doing all this shit? If this, let's say, for example, this is where the kid was sitting at. His dad was back here. You hear me? Let's do this again. If, it, if the kid was sitting here, his dad was back here. Right? So, boom, Cash ends up going back to his seat. He was on the steps. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought, so he was sitting right here by the steps, though. So his dad, he goes up, make an Instagram account, and then Zach went to go to get back to Cash. He, was, he, he went to go get back to Cash because he was asking Cash something. Cash comes back, and he sits in his chair. He says, yo, yo, can you, hey, Cash, can you tell him? Tell, yo, tell him I have Instagram. He said, all right, I'm going to tell him. Time go by, I stop paying attention to the kid, but he's still yelling shit. All of a sudden, I hear the kid yell, Richie, Richie, hey, Richie, come here. Richie, come back, come back, Richie. Richie, come here. I'm like, who the fuck is Richie? Who the fuck is Richie? I swear to God, the name was Richie. So Cash ends up leaving, he in the back talking to somebody. And I was like, you know what, <clears throat> I'm thirsty. Let me go get me another water. I end up going, <clears throat> and I keep hearing them yell, Richie, for so fucking long. And I go in the back, I say, who the fuck is Richie? Cash laughs and said, nobody. <laughs> so what I didn't know is, in the meantime, in the meantime, what didn't happen, what didn't happen, no, oh, hey, 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 no, uh, I thought he wasn't talking to Troy Dan. Troy Dan didn't come yet. Troy Dan wasn't in there yet. He's then talking. I, I realized when I stopped paying attention, Cash told him that Zach TTG name was Richie. And he was calling Zach back. So Zach could try to get, so he can give Zach his Instagram so he could be on, on Jezza's video. Cash lied and told this nigga Zach's name was fucking Richie. And nigga, I'm like, nah. <laughs> he, killed, he yelled Richie for like 10 minutes, nigga. But then guess who walks in? It's fucking Troy Dan. And guess who knows who Troy Dan is? The fucking kid. Troy Dan walk yeah, yeah, yeah. What's going on, guys? What's up? Troy Dan, super cool. Oh my god, it's Troy Dan! <laughs> Troy Dan, where's Dun J? Where's Dun? Troy. Uh, I, I, I don't know. <laughs> Hey, that nigga hit Jordan with the blitz, nigga. Hit him with the blitz of hell. I, 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 I don't know what Don J is. I don't know. I don't know. Whole time, nigga, Don J is fucking at, with, at Aiden's spot. Don J about to get ready to fight. If you don't know who Don J is, Don J is a kid. Troy Dan, if you don't know who that is, a big YouTuber in 2K space. Troy Dan used to play with a kid that was always cussed. His name was Don J. Nigga, Don J was with Aiden about to box. You asked about some motherfucking Don J. All right? So... Anyways, dog, he hit Troy Dan with the blitz. Troy Dan, I didn't see Troy Dan sit down the whole game. He couldn't because of the fucking kid, bro. The kid. So all of a sudden, I realized 
I'm sitting in my seat. I walk through the back one more time. I say, yo, Cash, why you ain't going to your seat? He say, nah, you tried to tell me, <laughs> nigga. Yo, that boy say, you tried to tell me. I should have listened, bro. I right, look, all I'm going to do is try to be a real nigga to you. When you came for that seat, I say, bro, if you remember this story, I say, listen, you about to be fried. You don't want this seat. But he didn't listen to me. And then guess what? When he said it's Troy Dan, let me tell you what. The motion Troy Dan got with the kids, all of the kids in the system got up. Oh, my God, it's Troy Dan. It's Troy. It was over for that nigga. Fried, cooked, done. So Troy Dan stayed the entire time sitting in the back like, I can't even get to my seat. It's over, bro. Now, luckily, let me try to see. Let's go on my phone because I don't want to miss anything. Let's see what this video is. Oh, hold on, look. <laughs> hey, I'm about to show you can't see. Hold on, nigga. I'm about to show y'all niggas. Uh, it ain't no cap in my motherfucking rap. In this video, you finna see Cash look like he going through it. Cash, bro scared the YouTubers. Yes, the fuck he did. He scared all other YouTubers. Shit, but bro, you missed a hell of a story time, but we got to buy it up. He scared the YouTubers, bro. Look at Cash. Bro, I swap seats. He got the seat of hell, boy. He don't even know, bro. Zach getting the picture. <laughs> they gonna look for right there. <laughs> look, bro. Look, bro. What's going down, bro? <laughs> Yo, so, so look, so. Yo, so right now, right now, they was like next to y'all. I'm telling you, he was next to us. He was right there. So, so boom. So Cash was like, so, 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 so the nigga was like, thank God Jezza wasn't here. And then look, you're going to hear Cash. Bro, he'll go crazy. <laughs> he'll throw up if he see Jezza. Because nigga, he kept bringing up Jezza's name. Hey. I watch Jester all the time. He says, can I come on your channel? <laughs> What's good, gang? So, <clears throat> later on, I don't want to skip. He finally ends up getting a picture with 50 Cent. I missed that part. Hold on. King Sai underscore just resubscribe Look. for 20 months. He go Troy Dan. 20th gang. Yo, appreciate you for the sub, bro. I really appreciate you. He go to video when Troy Dan came in. The Blitz. Y'all seen it was one kid. He yelling Cash and all that shit. I think it's because the other kids, they didn't really know who Cash was. Like, well, they know Cash, but they wasn't paying attention. The way he yelled when he seen Troy Dan, it was over. It was up. Watch, look at the amount of kids that came by the railing. Oh God, they found. Look at him. Look what he's telling Troy Dan. Oh God, they found Troy Dan. They found Troy Dan. They hit that nigga with the blitz. I hit him with a blitz. Oh my God. <laughs> Bro, they placed the shit out of Troy Dan. <laughs> oh my God, bro. Oh, he couldn't sit down. Oh my God, bro. And Cash is egging it on. You see Cash pointing, talking about Troy Dan. <clears throat> Nigga, they even had the grown ups getting up. Dog. Oh, let's see, game. Troy Dan, W YouTuber, ends up taking the picture with gang. Everything like that. What are they talking about? The intro. <laughs> intro is crazy. So, boom. Yo, I, I'm putting a vlog out. Honestly, I think I'm going to get up early tomorrow and try to put this vlog out. I'm going to tell y'all the truth. I hope y'all really enjoy the vlog. All right? So, what video was this? Let's see. That's when the game over, I think. 
Troiden got motion that way heavy AF. Yeah, I bro. didn't have to pay for a sub for three months because everyone kept gifting nonstop. Man, bro, I believe it, bro. Bro, Troiden, Troiden and his community go crazy. I talked to him a little while about streaming and shit like that too, bro. Like I said, another guy. That's my first time ever meeting Troy Dan. Super fucking cool guy. Super cool, all right? So I end up getting an interview with Cash. Matter of fact, y'all can watch that on the vlog tomorrow. There's no need for me to show that. Uh, ask him why he wouldn't go on his seat. All right? Look, bro, but we did eventually end up getting saved. And I put some of this in my chat, right? Blur his face and blow. Yeah, absolutely. That's what I'm going to do. All right? So boom. Right? Jacket hard. I appreciate you. So... What didn't happen up, what happened is, uh, you say what, nigga? Shannon Sharp with a BBL or uh, Ocho. What? You a freaky ass nigga. Get the fuck out of here, freak ass nigga. The fuck are you doing? Just say you want to crack them niggas, freak ass nigga. Nigga is wildin'. All right. So then. What then happens is, um, oh, security finally had enough of this little nigga because they realized we couldn't enjoy the game. We, like, he was so bad, we could not enjoy the game. What then happens is, oh, before that, he was like, hey, hey, guy in the pink, you somebody famous? Are you somebody famous? I said, no, no, you don't know me, no. Because he don't, he didn't know me, right? He said, are you somebody? I was like, no, bro. I'm not nobody famous. I thought I said, yo, Trey is Trey. I say, shut the fuck up. Shut up. He said, I know you. I seen you before I seen you. I said, I started telling him, bro, bro, you ain't seen me. Because I know you didn't see me. Like, I don't, I don't really have, I don't have a younger fan base. That's just not what I have, right? Now, there will be some kids that see me and know of me. But it's more likely dudes that's in the 15 to above range. That kid, if I had to put a guess on it, he was probably 10 or less. Probably not even 10, bro. That kid, less than 10. I don't, I don't really have those kind of kids that really come up to me like that, right? So, so he was like, you mean I show speed videos? Who the fuck is you talking about? I show speed. I said, I said, I said, look, bro. All right. <laughs> You can already tell he is a part of Co Mafia. <laughs> the Mafia is annoying hey, as fuck. Hey, my God. I, I will not say the Mafia annoying, man. Shout out to the Mafia, man. But, oh, he, yeah, he was in the Mafia, niggas. We got a video. We love you, Kai. That's the first video I put up. Nigga, listen on. We got this kid. Hold on. That trade fall. Listen to iPod. Listen to iPod. Listen to iPod. Listen to iPod being the L man's. And y'all talking about me in the Uber. Y'all talking about me in the Uber. Listen to iPod. That trade fall. He's yelling, is that Trey Soul? <laughs> Look, hold on. I'm fixing my face in this damn video. Whatever, it don't matter. That trade fall. Look how I look that game. John Boy 2228 <laughs> cheer dicks 100. You playing the game tonight, <laughs> bro? Yeah, I'm playing the game, bro. I will, I will, I will, I will. Uh, goddamn, it's 1244. All right. <coughs> you motion man for a no the fuck I'm not, bro. FL Studio soundbite. No, absolutely not, bro. Absolutely not. All right. So, but yeah, eventually security guard had enough of it, bro. I see this. I wish I would have vlogged it, bro. I'm an L vlogger for this because I peeped the play. The security guard got out of his seat and started going. And then I said, what's going on? So I stood up and I seen another security guard walking towards here. And they told little bro to get up and go to his seat. Oh, my God. It took two quarters. It took, it took two quarters for, him, for them to make him leave. Now, guess what happened? Lil Bro was down there five minutes later. He came back five more minutes. He came back five minutes later. And then, but the thing is, the security guard was looking for him. So he said, can I come back? I promise I'm not going to be annoying. 
Security guard said, no, no, and made him leave. And I ain't see him the rest of the night. Oh my God, bro. Didn't see him, hold on, let, let me make sure. Let me make sure I didn't miss him, because I might. This the end of the game. I was getting a thumbnail, thank God I didn't show y'all this. Yo, I got I got a clip of when Kyle was going crazy because they ain't getting the ball. Yo, they was hoeing the shit out of Kyle too, bro. Oh my god, that shit was it's hilarious in, in, in hindsight. Boy, Michael Parsons. I said you was cooking because in person I didn't know how many times you shot the ball. I just look up and you had 30. Michael Parsons, you shot 30, you had 31 shots to get 30. That's a nasty score line. It's a nasty, nasty score line, man. And that's nasty stat line, bro. You was shooting this shit out the ball, bro. <laughs> Hold on, let me make sure. It's cash in the seat. No, I didn't get when the security guard kicked him out. <clears throat> I think that's it. But yo, that was an annoying ass kid, man. That that kid. Shout out to y'all. Bro, shout out to y'all parents that, that brought y'all kids there. W parents, don't ever let your kid be the annoying kid, because that was ridiculous. This that was fucking ridiculous. All right. Um, let's see what we're doing. W story time, bro. We've been live for goddamn two hours and just talking about reactions and shit like that, bro. I ain't gonna lie. Having a W community, man. I appreciate y'all, boy. Let me tell you how this is a motherfucking lie. And I got proof. It's, look, again, I know the ego shits is jokes. But I'm finna show y'all how I have literally no ego. And I'm gonna show y'all. I got proof this time. It was nice you having you in the city over the stop. weekend. Trey touch my phone. Trey got the nut hands, y'all. I repeat, Trey has the nut hands. I will never tell a story that close to embarrassing again. Because you won't leave me alone. That was two years ago. That was two years ago. And you're still fucking with me you piece of shit you piece of shit bro can i say this stream is boy yeah i got you i got you games okay i got his instagram fly underscore just resubscribed for 21 months what story ye was up gang yo chat i got a question y'all remember hento bruh fall off was crazy hento Gento, Gento. Hey, guy in the pink. Why you homie on the water? That's why your water bottle small as hell. Spent all your money on them tickets can't buy real bottles. Kwame Brown looking nigga. Put me in a video. Get the fuck out of here, nigga. All right. Let me show you. No ego, no ego, no ego, man. So, it is after the dunk contest. I put on Twitter... I put on Twitter, uh, let's go to my Twitter. The video of Jalen Brown's last dunk. I was supposed to put up Max last dunk, but by the time I got to my phone, I realized nobody give a fuck. I'm not gonna upload it. I only uploaded Jalen Brown's, right? <clears throat> now I fucked my tweet up and I edited this tweet three times. I edited this tweet three times only because my dumb ass accidentally put live stadiums. So I was like, okay, let me get rid of the S. Then I accidentally put stadium and reaction together. And then after that, I finally fixed it and made it correct. Twitter blue haired ass. All right. So bang. I then tweet because Colin was like, okay, nigga, this like your third time. And then Flash says something as well. Editing three times is nuts. TSU education. To that, I will reply to this video. Hey, yo. Unless y'all niggas is walking in 16 degree weather with no gloves, don't worry about how much I edit my tweets. Don't worry about it. Also, I'm going to try to pull up the Mac tweet. But let me tell you what, bro. All right, the rest of that shit don't matter. Excuses. It is what it is. Now, what happens is after I post this video, 
My life become a living hell for the next 20 minutes. Okay? A living hell. I'm going to tell you why. Me and iPod was walking, but I had to separate from iPod because I said, you know, iPod, I went to Indy because I had to deliver somebody a grill. Now, sometimes when you deliver a grill, things might happen. Maybe I might have to adjust the grill sometime. Most of the time you don't, but it's a rare occasion I might have to adjust it. So the grill that I did in Indy, I don't know if they just didn't do a good mode or maybe it was a mistake on my end. I was like, you know what? I'm in the city. I will adjust it for you. I, I told them how to do it, but they were nervous. It's so easy to fix on your own, but this is the first time ever getting anything. They was nervous. All right. So um, I said, yo, I'm going to catch an Uber to you. I ordered an Uber. It said six minute wait time. It's 16 degrees outside, bro. And it's windy. I said, fuck. All right, I'll wait the six minutes outside. I'm waiting. Time go by, and I'm like, what the fuck is this fucking Uber, my nigga? Where is this Uber? I look up. It says, it said it was still confirming my fucking ride. So, I don't have a driver. It's still, conf it's still trying to find me a driver. So, that mean, it's another fucking 10, 15 minutes before my driver gets to me. I said, fuck that one. Let me cancel this and try to get another one. When I tried to get another one, my fingers are fucking cold. It said five minutes. I said, fuck. I wait another five minutes. I put my phone in my pocket because I had this phone. Outside, these phones are kind of like metal, whatever, whatever the fuck. They cold as fuck in your hands. It's 16 degrees. You can't hold these phones. I put that bitch up. I put it in my pocket. And I'm just, man, no, stop complaining. You wouldn't outside, motherfucker. You ain't, you ain't experienced that cold. You wasn't outside. You ain't, you had any, when you outside, you got gloves on, nigga. I'm from Texas. I don't know shit about this kind of weather, all right? Anyways, so at this point, this is how you know I was cold. I didn't know if my ears were mine or not. Do you understand what I'm saying? I did not know if my ears were mine or not. What do you mean? Early in that game, when I walked to the stadium, I had these glasses on, right? I end up taking the glasses off. And I was like, what the fuck is wrong with my ears? So I'm touching my ears. And them bitches is so numb, they don't feel like they my fucking ears that I'm touching. You hear me? I grabbed my phone to make sure I was grabbing my, I was grabbing my motherfucking ears. AJ, bro, get your ass on. I was grabbing my motherfucking ears, bro. I know exactly what you mean. Yeah, the niggas that know, no. It's that cold. Because I wasn't wearing a beanie. My stupid ass is wearing a fucking hat when it's cold outside. My ears went numb. Now, if my ears are numb, my fingers are fucking fried. I look at my phone now, still confirming the Uber. So then, so then the shit tells me, it tells me, um, now instead of waiting five minutes for an Uber, now nah, nigga, wait 13 minutes. On top of trying to confirm, I said, fuck that, I'm walking back. Now, at this point though, I had walked so far down, I don't know where the fuck I'm at. It's 16 degrees outside. It's windy. I'm walking. I'm cold as fuck. Done. Cold. Right? Let me try to find a video. I got a video on my phone when I was cold. Give me one second while I load these videos on my phone. I, I then said, fuck this shit. This motherfucker record everything. Not nah, because I knew I was vlogging. I say, fuck this. I got to go back. I start walking, and I don't know where the fuck I'm at, bro. Cold as fuck, post. And then let me get this one. And put that in Discord. Post, that should go quickly. So now, my dumb ass dry ass list. Am I shit look crazy right now? Fuck you, boy. Anyways, it don't matter. So anyways, now I'm walking and I don't know where I'm at. I'm going up to people, excuse me. You know, I get to the convention center. Because in Indiana, in, in Indianapolis, they got a convention center that's like in the middle of downtown, essentially, right? 
I think it was down. I think I think we was in that. Yeah, we was in that downtown area. Damn, they Indianapolis is a little ass town. <laughs> but if you go through downtown, they got a skywalk where you can go through everything and not be cold. I know I need to get back to this convention center as soon as possible. I'm fucking freezing, nigga. So while I was walking, I seen some dope ass shit. The NBA went all out for All Star Weekend in Indy, bro. They did, bro. They changed so they changed so many of the streets to like uh, Mavs Avenue, uh, Nuggets Road, whatever. Guapo, what the fuck is this? And look, look what this nigga did to me, yo. Can you make it an emo? <laughs> Real. <laughs> what the fuck would the name of this emo be? I ain't gonna lie, bro. I'm going to the gym tomorrow on my mama, bro. On my mama, I'm going to the gym tomorrow, bro. Like, real shit, this is a typical Houston nigga right here. Like, this look like, damn, it's an H-Town nigga for real. Lord Jesus, syrup sipping animal. I need, I'm going to the gym tomorrow, nigga. Oh my God, bro. Trey Ross, bro, I'm going to the gym, nigga. They went all out. And I wish I could have vlogged and found this way sooner. The NBA had like these fucking LED shits that was up in the sky. It was just sitting and just floating around. And um, this shit was amazing, bro. Hold on. You're going to hear me talking. And I think I fucked my video up. So y'all going to get a glimpse of when I fuck videos up and I redo them. But who cares? Yeah, it changes. Oh, what the fuck? Hold on. I don't know why the quality shit, but cold outside, so I gotta be quick. But like, I don't know if y'all can see this shit. Like, what the fuck? This shit is so fire, bro. We doing catfish anymore? Yes. Moving this shit. What the fuck? So they got like this thing in the air, and the nigga actually dunks like, and it's mind blowing. World Star has quality. I hope it don't look like that when I'm putting this shit on my video because it gotta go on video. It gotta go YouTube. But it's mind blowing, right? But again, in the towards the end of this video, I said, that's enough, it's cold. I don't care. All right, that was tough. All right, now you done. It's cold in a bitch. Super cold, right? So now, later on, that same thing, the motherfucker, they even put Halliburton face talking and shit. Yo. Bro, get a picture, bro. Yo, what's up? I got you. A sub sees me outside while I'm lost, fingers frozen, and I'm looking fucking crazy. I'm looking crazy, dog. So I'm trying to put this shit in the vlog. Yo. Bro, you get picture, bro. Yeah, what's up? I got you. You sound out of breath. No, nigga, I sound cold. So then I take the picture with the sub. I'm like, I took the picture. It's cold in the bitch. I say, I say, bro, I'm so sorry. I hope I don't look crazy in your video. It's cold in the bitch. Right? Look how I look at my nigga pictures. Bro, y'all, y'all could have took multiple pictures, bro. <laughs> I look fucking nuts. Uh, <laughs> I look crazy. <laughs> ah. <laughs> ah. <laughs> but remember this, how you know, like I say, I don't got no ego, bro. It's 16 degrees and nigga, I, I'm still out here taking pictures. I had no business taking pictures, nigga. But I was like, bro, I can't tell no sub, no. I can't tell a sub, no, no hoodie. Bro, my dumb ass, I'm a Texas nigga, bro. I don't be knowing shit about nothing, bro. Dumb ass nigga, bro. I had no business being outside like that, bro. But, all right.